Good morning friends. Today I am going to show you a very interesting topic where a company or an organization can set some of the interesting challenge for their members to achieve some of the targets. So setting a target in any object is possible now with gamification tool. Odoo called it gamification because it keeps engaging uh, the users or the employees and then earn some type of rewards. So uh, in standard Odoo, once you install this app which is called gamification, you will see HR gamification and CRM gamification. Both have different objectives. So this is the base gamification I have installed. And then once I search, it will take me to different challenges. So here you can see running challenges are there and there are many different challenges. The best example for every user who is uh, watching this video, like when you see Odoo courses on odoo.com portal, you are going to earn or you are earning right now some of the badges like uh, you have achieved 2500 points and some badge like hero, superhero kind of thing. In forum also it is granting. So it is nothing but coming from this challenge only. You can see. So what we do, I am going to show you how one can create different challenges for their employee. So I am creating one challenge and let's see today's challenge is for recruitment team. So I am setting a recruiting target okay, for internal user and then it should be monthly target and I am setting date for this month and it will run up to end of December. Okay, And then I am setting reward who is going to achieve this. I will grant a batch brilliant to them and here I have to set a goal which is the logical goal I have to set on what basis the target has to be set. So here if I go again I'm duplicating window into this goal definition. So here goal definitions are there. You can see a standard available goal definition okay. but I want to set something new. So here I have set applicant count based on number of records the model is applicant and based on creation date I want to track it and this batch mode I want to track each and every recruiter with their user ID to generate a count. Okay. So this model I have created and now I am going to attach this model over here the game is applicant count and then I am setting target like from every recruiter I want 10 applications. As soon as I start challenge it will start calculating what is inside. So here if I go to my jobs position you can see five applicants are there. Okay, which was by AC Tech is my employee, Sales One is my employee, and Mustafa myself. There's three one one applicant. So here in target, when I go to goal definition, I can see Mustafa has already logged three, AC Tech has one, okay, and Sales one. So now if I go to applicant and create one new, and here if I say Sales two. Who is also creating and launching launching one application over here and if I go to goal definition so when I go to sales 2 I refresh it will count to one because he has logged one application over here so this way you can set target for your recruitment team we can set another challenge also for team like a monthly sales target so in goal definition I have created one more model total sales and based on sum of the field the sum will be total amount of sales order from the creation date and that's again I want to divide by salesperson and user ID so this definition I have set and here I am launching it total sales and I want to set target of let's say 5 lakh rupees okay and whoever is going to get success i will say good job and only uh, the first user will get brilliant 
for second user i can set good job for third user subsequently i can make more badges so this is when i start i go to related goals you can see like represent tech has already logged 10500 rupees and then this one has got nothing so if i share here refresh challenge and goal target we can see so now if i'm going to log sales order in the name of sales person 2 who is going to make some sales during this month worth 50000 and here the sales person is my key to track the target to sales 2 is there and i confirm so now if i go here in related goals and refresh my sales to target we can see this amount so he has achieved his target out of 5 lakh to 52500 and this you can see in this report also and if i want to make some additional view i am just going into studio and let's check if i can activate pivot view over here so yes pivot pivot view is available and this i can make by user and with the goal definition i want to current value remind delay and to reach so here you can see this sales target of 5 lakh rupees is mentioned over here and current value is mentioned over here and then we can say i want to track by month then it will launch month because currently it doesn't have the month criteria so yeah it is not showing but once you have month then you can define this and you can insert into spreadsheet and calculate their commission also so now this is correlated with spreadsheet and this is how you can track and uh, create some goals for your team so goal can be made or challenge can be made available to any object which has some count some record count some calculation on the basis of total amount you can do this hope this will help many people many users many organization to set some goals and uh, engage their employees and users and then uh, make some achievement and grant some badges and rewards thank you